Italy is a popular destination for tourists all over the world, where almost everyone can find something important to them, be it gastronomy, culture, historical sites, or the seaside and beaches. However, Italy is famous not only for these entertainments, but also for its dogs, and for good reason. Today, FCI lists 14 dog breeds whose country of origin is Italy. Some of these breeds are quite popular and known all over the world, but some owners do not even know that their pet is ultimately an Italian breed. In this short compilation, we list the 10 most well-known and popular Italian breeds. Let us know in the comments which one you would choose and which one you would like to watch a breed introduction video about. 10. Volpino Italiano of the 10 breeds listed here, Volpino is perhaps the rarest outside Italy. Italian sinologists trace the origin of Volpinos back to around the 15th century, and based on current data, they were used in the Italian countryside as vigilant signal dogs and for rodent extermination. Like other small dogs, they were discovered in noble courts in the late Middle Ages and became increasingly popular primarily as companion dogs for ladies. Despite their small stature, this Spitz-type dog is extremely active and is a good signal dog, requiring a lot of patience and dedication to keep. 9. Maltese Despite its name, FCI considers the Maltese to be an Italian dog breed, perhaps one of the most ancient Mediterranean dog breeds. This tiny dog, weighing barely 2 to 4 kilograms and not taller than 25 centimeters, has always functioned as a companion dog, in the early modern period there was almost no noble court where Maltese dogs were not the entertainers. This small dog is very good-natured and friendly, does not require much exercise, but extremely intelligent, eager to learn and please its owners with any tricks that can be learned. It is no coincidence that they have become so popular today. 8. Abraco Italiano, Italian Pointer Sinologists consider Bracco Italiano to be one of the oldest European pointer dogs. According to our current knowledge, its ancestors may have developed around the 4th or 5th century in northern Italy and from their spread throughout Italy. Due to the spread of modern hunting firearms, they were on the verge of extinction around the 18th century, but, fortunately, devoted fans of the Italian pointer managed to save the breed. Bracco Italianos are larger and more massive than the most well-known pointers, easier to live with, as they are generally balanced, calm and well-intentioned. 7. Bergamo Shepherd Dog Well, this is the Italian dog breed that videographers often confuse with the Hungarian Pulley and Commandor breeds. This is no coincidence, since the Bergamo also earned his living as a herding shepherd and his fur is prone to felting, but unlike the Pulley, their workplace was not the plain territories, but the pastures of the Italian Alps for centuries. The past of the Bergamo Shepherd is still mostly speculative. Like other herding dogs, the Bergamo is an extremely intelligent and human-centered dog, but at the same time lively, exercise-intensive breed, which in our time has increasingly found its living space in Italian families, similarly to the Hungarian Pulley. 6. Italian Greyhound the Italian Greyhound is one of the smallest greyhounds in the world, which has become quite popular among companion dogs nowadays as a pet, which is quite surprising since they are ultimately greyhounds. Perhaps one of the main reasons for this is that although Italian greyhounds love to run, when indoors with their owners, they are extremely manageable, they are among the quietest breeds in the world and can stretch on sofas for long hours if there is nothing else to do. 5. Ligato Romagnolo Legato, which, in the local Romagnolo dialect actually means duck dog, is perhaps one of the most ancient water dog breeds, which is becoming super popular in Europe just now, because of which breed lovers are not very happy about. For centuries, legatos have been used by fishermen to catch fish sticking out of nets and to sniff out duck colonies. At the turn of the 19th and 20th centuries, they were used in large numbers to find and locate truffles. By our time, Ligato Romagnols are much less considered to be working dogs, because of their extremely kind nature, they have found their place in family homes. 4. Abruzzo Shepherd Dog The Abruzzo Shepherd Dog, or Mareman, as they are known all over the world, 
is a shepherd dog of eastern origin, very similar to the Great Pyrenees and the Hungarian Cuvass, which is extremely popular and widely used in the USA and Canada. The Mermans performed classic shepherd dog duties in the Italian Apennine Mountains for centuries and became the idealistic shepherd dogs of the Western Hemisphere. 3. Neapolitan Mastiff Who does not know this iconic breed, the Neapolitan Mastiffs, who, for centuries, have been excellent working dogs in Italy. This huge and powerful dog breed was the symbol of toughness and perseverance in Italy even in the Middle Ages, when they were used for almost every task, from guard and protection duties to dog fights. If you look at a photo of Neapolitan Mastiffs living in the 1950s, you will be shocked to see a huge, muscular and agile working dog that you can really imagine can do anything. If you look at today's radiator back Ed Napolitans, you can't imagine this about this dog. Thus, over the years, the Neapolitan Mastiff has also become a symbol of the sacrifice of human fashion breeding. 2. Bolognese Dog, or Bolognese Bichon This tiny small dog started in Italy, but has had a dizzying historical career. They were always companion dogs, and were adored by such world-famous ladies like Madame de Pompadour, the Medici princesses, Catherine the Great and Maria Theresa. Their popularity spans the ages, as they are still one of the most popular companion dogs today. This is perhaps no coincidence, as the Bolognese is an extremely loyal and affectionate little creature, who is friendly, playful and affectionate at the same time. They do not require too much exercise, are excellent even in smaller apartments, in this respect they are ideal for today's urban places. 1. Cani Corzo For many, including the creators of this channel, the Cani Corzo is the dog with a capital letters, since a Corzo from a good bloodline embodies almost everything that most people expect from a dog. They are gentle with the family, but can be tough with strangers, you can count on them in trouble, they are extremely intelligent, learn easily, but you have to make them feel who is the boss. Of course, like all good dogs, the origin of the Cayani Corzo is surrounded by many myths, like ancient Roman origins, war dogs, etc. However, the reality is, that Corzos were the all-rounder dogs of the southern Italian peasant farms, the La Fattorias, where they had to be ready for almost any tasks, from here they inherited their versatility. They had to guard the family estate, but they were hunting dogs as well, herded cattle if necessary, and they played together with the children of the family. By the end of the 1960s they had almost disappeared, and from the 1970s the breed was regenerated from a few dozen survivors, found on farms in southern Italy. Today, their story is a real success story, although fashion and mass demand did not leave the Cani Corzos untouched.